Zegas. We have just gotten up and today we are going to the Chinese market. We were going to go the other day but we were too tired. So John has today off and we're going today. And I need to do something about the hair and I have parcels. So yes, that's a good opening. John has some parcels for me as well but these are the interesting ones. Ignore the sofa, the sofa's rubbish at the minute. But I have this one, which is her, which is severely darker than the picture, I think. I don't know. I need to make pigtails, so I got to make the pictures for cosplay. I have a lot of stuff coming that I've ordered for the cosplays. There's two different cosplays getting made. There isn't a little... Oh, here, I use this little handy tab to open this devil's spit stuck down crap. Oops. So this is... Ooh, this three. As you can tell, I don't have that one. I think it's meant to be bad. I have contact lens cases. So I have contact lenses. There are three packets. I ordered two contact lenses. Um, yes, so pinky. Pinky parrot. Yes, so Pinky Paradise, I tried ordering another pair of yellow contact lenses from them. Technically, they are brown contact lenses, but I needed to order some for my cosplay. And I had £9 in points, so... And they also had a, we'll send you a free gift for Christmas. So I gave it a go. Those are my green ones. Here I can get them out. These are very severely green ones. Because I need pretty shockingly green eyes. Let's see. I don't know which one to open next now. Red. Oh, these these are Free sample gift. Oh, these are weird. Uh, I don't know if I can get you to see them without tipping it. Or the brightness freaking out because it's so white in there. Oh yeah, little flecks of red. They are quite bizarre. These ones are both different tops. Um, they say they're the same lenses. I think. Help. Uh, two different lots. Slightly different manufacture dates. I wish they put the thingy number on them, the lens number. Yes, I get these. And they're meant to be like super yellow. We've watched pictures, well, I've seen pictures of people, but they don't look super yellow to me. They just look maybe a bit orangey. So yes, I got them for cheaper than I should have and I got a free pair of lenses, which are weird as all well, hell. Huh? I think I'm going to try the brown ones today. See, so, uh... If they work. Because <laughs> the last time... Not the, the last time wasn't so good. I haven't released a video as of yet. Probably be out before this is out. Mm. Anyway, cup of tea. Need to get ready.
needs it. Yeah. The hair is, as always, the hair. Painted the nails. Did I show you? I showed you. Oh, but painted the nails more. I hope it's sparkle. Ooh, sparkle. Anyway, see you in a bit. Hi. Um, yeah, John's just opened the post and he got me my lactose tablet so I can eat. What's it called? Dairy. Because I'm lactose intolerant. You wouldn't know it, the amount of cheese and stuff I eat. And also a new phone case because my phone case is, uh, this is my old phone case and it's kind of like poking through around here and it's cracked up here. It's poking through here and then, go away Pokemon. And then it's cracked here and cracked here and cracked here and cracked here. <laughs> scratched. I have had it a while. Oh, my camera's a bit scratched as well. So yeah. But this one is like, it's like the back of your phone. And it has all like bits in it. I don't know. I'm not sure how it works. Okay. Ah, it's already scratched. Ah. You, you saw that? I did not do that. So these are the brown contact lenses that are supposed to be a bit yellow. I mean, on camera they look a bit yellow, but in person they just look brown. So, I don't know. Face we are back. We went to two different supermarkets. I I'm pooped. And I feel a bit sick. Because I was feeling a bit sick this morning when I was asleep. And then I've just been eating in the car and looking at Pokemon. And I get travel sick a bit sometimes. Especially when I'm looking down and eating in the car. So, yeah, that didn't help. But yes, I'm pooped. I, uh... We bought some stuff. Most of it's downstairs at the minute. We got like some dashi miso, some stuff to make our own for a khaki because two places and they didn't have fur a khaki. Well, one did, but it was egg fur a khaki or salmon fur a khaki, and I didn't want either of them. I wanted either seaweed or bonito. And then we got. Like sushi rice and ramen noodles and some sumai, some Hong Kong banana cakes, some chicken bao, which is steamed chicken bun, uh, tofu, just general stuff. Soy sauce, sushi rice vinegar, you know. I, I forgot to take the list and yeah. I don't know where it is. It's probably in my bag and I just haven't found it. <laughs> but yeah, so we got snacks as well. I will show you the snacks in a bit when I'm feeling a bit better. But for now, I'm going to have a matcha latte because I got some instant matcha lattes to try. And be pooped. I have noticed recently. <laughs> All my vlogs when I was uploading them to the computer because I haven't been feeling well and I've been a bit meh and I've always been tired and whatnot. I kind of look like a potato on most of the uh, thumbnails so I'm like it's not good when you resemble a potato. Anyway. Oh and the crisps I wanted to get the banana crisps. I stopped at 10 packets. <laughs> Because they were reduced to 30p, so I had to buy lots of them because they won't be getting them again. So, I'll show you them in a bit. But for now, I need to take the shoes off and curl up and have a drink and have a rest. Yeah. So, we'll see you in a bit. Bye. So, I've had a little lie down and a bit of a matcha latte. Mm. It's actually quite tasty. Um, need to be 
Yeah, it's, it kind of feels like it's missing from something, though. Hmm. Anyway, um, we eat but snacks. Some of them are still downstairs, as I said. This one's in the... F I'm not even filming my face. This one's in the fridge. I brought the rest. <laughs> oh. That's mostly one. That's mostly the crisps. Let me pop you down there. Let's see what we have. Peking Duck Thai K Night. Which is crispy seaweed. It's a seaweed snack. They stopped doing my favourite one, it looks like, because Noah had it. My favourite one was the prawn tempura one. It was so good. This, finally, all through Liverpool, everywhere. Like, there was one shop and it had a sign that they did the wafers in peach. And I'm like, oh, they sound really nice. Nowhere ever did them. We've been looking for, what, like over a year now for them? Oh, we found them, so we bought two packs. Because I do, I do quite like a bit of peach. And we got some um, matcha cola. Um, like I said on my other video, I like the matcha. I, I like cola uh, cookies. They're like little wafers with cream filling. And these ones are the matcha flavour. There is a lot of matcha stuff. I don't know whether there's an influx of matcha stuff because some of the stuff we haven't seen before, like this one. Matcha Hello Panda Cookies. We don't know whether it's because it's Chinese New Year or what, but there seems to be quite an influx of matcha. Let me get these mochi. Mochi are... It's not two words, it's actually one word in Japanese. But mochi are glutinous rice cakes. They're these googie rice cakes. It's made out of glutinous rice flour. And they're really chewy. And there is actually quite a lot of deaths per year in Japan due to mochi because people choke on them. But these ones, I haven't seen these flavours before. And they are um, plum, pomelo and passion fruit. So they sounded really nice to try. I don't know if it's, I'm, I'm assuming it's like plum, pomelo, passion fruit, or not all together. There's a lot of sugary stuff on the outside of these ones though. Normally there isn't. And then we got these mochi rolls to try. We've had the Yuki and the loved ones before, the proper little mochi, and they seem all right. Uh, as far as pre-packaged mochi goes, um, or mochi, um, handmade mochi, and it is green tea with creamy filling, so they look good to try, let's see, green tea paste and milk flavour filling stuff, potato powder, hmm, that'll be what they've rolled it in, uh, See, got another matcha, matcha uh, marshmallows. These ooky little filled marshmallows. They're really soft and ooky. Ooky, 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 ooky. Um, I used to try uh, mini churros, like crisps. That's French. That's German. Original store in a dry place. Doesn't really describe them. It just tells you the ingredients. But they're like crispy cinnamon churros. And then the rest. Okay, we got, we got these as well, which is uh, caramel flavor cream wafers. But I just heard the Sakura on the top of the back, and I was like, "Oh, they look cute!" 
And apparently they have cappuccino flavour, cookies and cream and chocolate flavour, but I thought caramel would be nice, a bit different. And I know you can get these types of things in like pound shops and that, but look at the Takara! Mmm, so pretty. I think I'll keep that tin for something. Even though it says wafers, I can store something in like makeup brushes. And then these. These are probably one of the worst things. Oh, zero trans fats, though. One of the worst things to eat. Uh, banana. Okay. Banana kick banana snack with artificial flavour. And they're like, what's it? But sweet banana flavour. And it's so good. But yes, do it all reduced to 30p. So. I think the last time we bought them we were like over a quid or something, weren't they? Yeah, I think they were about 90 Yeah, it's somewhere between just under or just over. And I bought one pack and I was like, they look a bit weird, I'm gonna try them. I like banana. And uh, yeah, I really ended up liking them. Hey, that's why they're reduced. They're at date. Well, yeah, they're gonna be close to the no, I didn't know whether it was because they were getting rid of them because they were stopping selling them. That's why I bought so many. I don't mind a little bit, I don't. Uh, so yeah, they're the stuff we got for upstairs. Oh, and this, I forgot this. This is a uh, melon soy milk. Melon flavoured soya milk. Which has skim milk powder in it. That's not right. Oh, it's got vitamins. It contains fish product. What? What's the fish product? I have no idea. But apparently it contains fish product. Might be where they got one of the, uh... Vitamins from. Ground up fish. Fish, melon, soy, milk, that's skim milk. Anyway, yes, that's what we got. And then we got banana cake um, downstairs. And like I said, we have chicken bao, which is chicken and shiitake bao, which looked good. And we had a honey bun on the way home, which was like a, like a cakey pastry with coconut custardy filling and honey on the outside. Not bad. I wanted to try the uh, chestnut Swiss roll because I don't like uh, horse chestnuts. Is it? Yeah. Yeah? No. Horse chestnuts are the bad one. Just chestnuts are the good one. I don't know. The, the ones you use as conkers aren't good to eat. They're poisonous. Um, but yeah, they had chestnut Swiss roll and it looked so good, but it was quite big and John wouldn't eat it because he doesn't do chestnut, but it looked good. And they also had tiger skin, tiger skin chocolate Swiss roll, which looked a bit weird. But there was a lot of stuff that we would have, one of us would have picked up, but we already have quite a bit of stuff. But yeah, no fur khaki. Fur khaki. Um, did confuse the guy in the shop because he was just some scouse. <laughs> and he's like, what oh, fur khaki? <laughs> so, fur khaki. I thought, what's that? And I'm like, it's a Japanese seasoning for rice. And he's like, let me go ask someone else. And then he got the, one of the guys that is obviously worked there longer. He's like, oh yeah, just get this, uh, seaweed and sesame thing. Which did, in fact, when I looked at it closer when I got home, I did have pictures of it on rice. So I'm going to mix some bonito in with that. And make some of my own furikake. I'm sure I've already talked about furikake. I know I told you about the egg. And salmon flavoured ones. Um, and we couldn't find the broth mix that we normally get. 
So we've got another one to try, a port, another port gone because that's pretty much, it's a decent, um, you know, it's meaty but it's not, you know, like beef, it's like too strong of a flavour, so it's kind of like the chicken of the meat world. Mm. <laughs> this and dumpling sauce. Didn't say dumpling sauce. I'm sure there was other things. Mochi. Um, no, not dessert mochi. Um, ones to try in soups and whatnot. Um, they're like hard ones that you gotta cook properly. So I've wanted to try them, and I'm pretty sure you can grill them or oven cook them or something, and they go all poofy and they get a crispy outer on that looks good. I have to look into it. And I think that's it. there was some bits downstairs like dashi stuck. But I can't think. There was some stuff I left downstairs but there was kitchen type stuff. I found the cutest uh, nori sheets, but we had already bought the nori from the first place. And they were actual little packets of little individual nori sheet sections for making onigiri with the nori wrapped around it. It was so cute. It had a little picture of onigiri on it. So, yeah. But anyway, I'm going to finish my matcha latte. I have a little bite to eat. And then, if I try anything, because a lot of the stuff I haven't tried before, but if we try anything, I will film it. I don't know what we're having for dinner. Possibly the bow, but I don't know. Um, so, and I will see you in a bit. Bye. So we have just had croissant. John so I kind of inhaled mine. And, um, it's, I'm having another matcha green tea latte, because they're very tasty. And we are having the banana cake. And um, uh, yeah, they they have a vast different meaning of cake in China. Is is the cake, and it's it's it kind of tastes like banana, but it's kind of not great. It kind of tastes like. Mm-hmm. But it doesn't taste like cake. It doesn't taste like mochi. It's got kind of a knack taste to it. Sorry if you saw all the food in my mouth. There's something to taste knack in there. I know. I'm gonna eat the rest of it and then lie down and watch some YouTube. So I'll see you in a bit. Bye.